press the bell icon on your YouTube app to be the first one to get notified when a video goes live. Hello and welcome to a new episode of TIY. Also, a very first full episode shot here in this new setup. I feel quite excited to shoot here. Hope you are liking it and also are getting used to this setup. Moving further, we have a new project suggestion today. Let's see what it is and who is it from. Okay, so Niyati has something for us. What is it? Hmm, roses made from aluminium bowls. Interesting. Well, thank you Niyati for suggesting us this project. Actually, it's been quite a while since I've tried any kind of a rose here on this channel. And from my past records, I've always been successful in making those. So I feel quite positive about this one. So without wasting any time, let's go and try it out. So the project suggests that we take an aluminium bowl and cut it this way. Actually, I couldn't get aluminium bowls, so I got these foil coated ones instead, as these are easily available. And I guess these should work pretty well also. Once you cut it this way, give each petal a rounded shape. After trimming, it should look something like this. Now fold the edges outwards. Go ahead and make a ball of aluminium foil of size of a tiny egg and glue it in the middle of the bowl. I'll advise you to use super glue for this entire project. Now fold in alternate petals and stick it to the foil ball. And stick the rest over the petals. Do not forget to use super glue only. Hmm, this looks like an inner bird of a rose. Now all we need to do is Add more layer to it and stick it the same way as the first one. I'll do that and come back. Five layers gone and now the last one. Done. And this is how the final product looks. And it looks awesome. Yay! Another successful rose project here on this channel. I'm definitely getting good at it. Well, did you guys ever imagine while eating those pani puris that the bowl they come in can be transformed into roses? No, right? That is why I love DIY so much. Well, this project for its simplicity has to get a DIY thumbs up. That means you should definitely try it yourself. I also have one more important work for you. That is to like, comment and share this video. And don't forget to subscribe to Confused Genius. Do it now. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.